Oh, look, I'm here, I'm back with some new wall decor. Right up, right there. I'm gonna be honest, I'm not the best texter in the world, but that doesn't mean I don't get annoyed when other people are terrible texters. So I thought, why not just make a guide for everybody in this video so that you're gonna be less hated by your friends, by your family, and by your significant others. So if you follow these six rules of text, texting, text, text, texting, you know, you might be in the clear and you might make some friends and keep some friends. I don't know. Rule number one, don't abbreviate everything because other than me slitting your throat, people, we're not Detective Perot. We we can't solve these riddles. So if you text somebody with I-D-K-I-I-R-C, I-Y-K-W-I-M, but J-S-Y-K-I-M-H-O-G-O-F, -I, I can't even read this script because that's just obnoxious. The occasional OMG for dramatic effect is fine. Just please, just, I wanna be able to read it. That also brings me to my next point. Point number two, use proper English, please. But unless you're being funny, there's no excuse not to. Stop, be a smart person. I write my text like prose and I expect everybody else to do the same. Rule number three is don't say LOL because you're not. I know you're not. LOL means, oh, you're trying to be funny, so I should say something that indicates that your previous statement was supposed to be amusing, so I'm just gonna say LOL. Really, I'm just sitting here like, what the f is wrong with you? I'm onto you, mother <laughs> LOL is just something that you say when it's awkward, which there's nothing worse than a lone LOL. Which brings me to rule number four, single word responses. Just don't do it, don't do it, don't do it, please don't do it. Even just one one word response signifies that you want the conversation to end or that you're mad at somebody. Which, surprise, segue to rule number five, is don't just stop the conversation out of nowhere. Listen, I know that I'm forgettable and I have nothing going for me in the looks department, but that does not mean you can just flat out ignore me. I need attention to live. That's why I make YouTube videos. There's no reason to just flat out stop a conversation with someone unless A, your house is on fire, or B, your cat clawed your eyes out. Otherwise, I don't wanna hear it. That's just rude because if you just don't want to talk to me, that brings me to rule number six. And that is, make up excuses. It spares their feelings and it makes you look nicer. Excuses include, my house is on fire, my cat just ripped my eyeballs out, and my favorite excuse is, oh my god, my house is on fire, and my cat just ripped my eyeballs out. All really great. They can't even be like, you don't even own a cat, because you're gonna be like, I just rescued one from the fire. Not funny. Why do I have subscribers? It's really that simple. Just follow those six rules to texting success and you're gonna be a texting champ in no time. In no time, because those rules are flawless. Maybe you shouldn't follow my rules. Eh. Okay, before I annoy you or me anymore, I'm just gonna go. Make sure you comment, rate, subscribe, and I will see you guys soon. I love ya, bye.